Yeah, two lean, tall fighters here in the lightweight division. I'm excited for this match. I have been. So am I. Both very, very talented. Let's see. Preparation. Well, looking very lively. Round one. Good. Sharp left kick. Angelo. Oh, that's a right hand again. Hadji's very good at just keeping it with his back to the ropes. Beating him up here. That was a good shot again. That right hand again. That team. Body shot. Going downstairs. Going to go back upstairs with it now. Being smart here. Oh, nice left hook from Bob. He seems comfortable working on the back leg. Being pushed did up last time, though, against didn't the front. He? Just leaned out the way of that one. Al Hadji looking for the right hand. It's a difficult customer to deal with. He does have sly moves like the Fox. Yeah, he needs a kick as well. Like, see him set, set the, the right hand up with a leg kick. What a watch, Bolt's left hook, you know. See, strong punch that. We'll see. Good low kick. Rubber the count of himself. Oh! Good combinations, and as I said, that he walks into a storm of punches. He's got guards up high as well. He knows Fulp has that left hook. Oh, oh. a strong uppercut. I heard that one. Fulp has. Working on the outside. Maggi looking calm. Looking for the shot. Sorry, I got watching that. <laughs> you know, sometimes you just end up watching it because it's so good. Yeah. It's a very calculated fight. For me, Al Haji needs to step his game up with the combinations rather than looking for the hands only. In control, that uh, standing there with a jab in distance, slaying back from the game. Grabbing away. Looks for the left hook over the top. Nice knee. Landed with the body kicks. with the hook. Minute and 20 left. Of a very, very clinical performance. Mel Haji. Coming up, one minute on the clock. There's no quit involved, though. There isn't. Really? I've no, I'm a fan of his so technique, I. his heart, and the willpower to drive. He's very comfortable on the back hook, but he's naturally that kind of fighter. Should let him in, should let him in, Yusuf. Don't get overconfident. Because Fulp's got some power in them shots. Yes, he's using them well. Certain fighters got the X factor, and Yusuf has it. He really does. I just wish he'd use his legs more, Yusuf. Oh, Haji. Beautiful Good knee name. up through the centre. Throw more of them. End the round three. Very it's a good end fight. The fight. fight. Yeah, it was a good fight. It really was. But he was El Haji all day. I think Bob had very good technique. He did, he did but up. he didn't win. He, he did, but he didn't win. He got right, dropped, he didn't he, as well, drop, in the second yeah, round? Of course. But I thought, listen, Volpe, 100% is a right fine, isn't he? And he's going to give everyone anyone trouble. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it's an exciting day. Yeah, for sure. Exciting time. 
this ground, keep it Volk on that back against the ropes. Volk did come, try and come back with his own answers. Did take a lot of shots though, especially right hands from Al Haji. That was a beautiful shot. Most of the time, tried to come back with some returns. Yeah, so yeah, so did I. I mean, like I said, Two no Angelo wasn't there. Remembered him from ECE, and yeah. Yeah, I combat. really like his style. He got caught there, but see how he controlled himself. Canvas at the end of round two. Round three, it was no stopping him though. Al Haji tried to push forward. Just jabbing, landing there, showing his excellence of his head movement. He delivered some nice knees as well, Al Haji, in this round. There we go, up through the centre. Nice fine. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a unanimous decision. The winner is from the red corner, Yusa! Sure, we're going to see more of the fox. And again, Al Haji takes that win home with him. Seems to be on a roll at the moment. Yup, yup, and Giving him a little push there. Well, Yusuf, you looked over at me when the decision was being announced with a disappointed look up across your face. Why was that? I don't know, uh, Vinny. A little, a little bit uh, disappointed. Didn't came, uh, was a little stiff. You know, I couldn't do uh, too much. You've just fought a very good fighter. He was very, very tough indeed. Took some good shots. But there was a game plan, wasn't there? Because that right hand every time was landed on target. Was that something you and uh, Kamal worked on in the gym? Yeah. Uh, we saw his uh, fights. And uh, we saw he's a little bit sloppy with his hands. He's not a great boxer. He has a little bit... Uh, Puts his hands a little bit uh, down. He had a dangerous left hook, though. He started to use that later on. Did you, you thought, you, did you think you had him done in the second round? You hit him with a beautiful combination, and he was down on his knees. Did you think that was it? No. Yeah, I thought it was it, but uh, saved by the bell. Saved by the bell, indeed. Well, listen, listen I, I just said this on commentary. I'm not going to lie. Certain fighters have got the X factor. You certainly have that. I'm a big fan of yours, and I can't wait to see you again. Thank you, Vinny. I want to thank the audience, the people who came to see my fight. Thank you all, Yes Feet, Team Elite, love, support for the Moroccans. Thank you guys.